I got my first Land Rover back in 1990 and the guys here at British Off-Road have been servicing ever since and it, actually it's Mark who I want to introduce who's been working on them all this time. How are you, Johnny? Mitch? How are you? I'm good. Just chasing Mark. Oh, I am indeed. Won't be a minute. No worries. How are you? Good, mate. What's going on? Oh, it's all happening. I just thought I'd bring the camera and show everyone what British Off-Road does and how you're part of the Australian Bushman DVDs and what you do for me and on my trucks. So you got the old Mustang all serviced up for us? Yep, she's ready to go again. Good stuff. But while we're here, why not go through and just give us a run through on these ones? Yep, sure. The uh, First of all, we've got the 200 uh, Colt. It's designed for, you know, your younger teenage type ones. It's the smallest thing we sell. Yep. And uh, plenty of plenty of fun for the kids and quite capable too. It looks pretty nifty. Yeah, the kids love them. And they, it's hard to keep them away from my kids. <laughs> and then uh, next next there, we've got the um, the 800. It's a diesel. It's a, it's a real workhorse. High and low, of course, two and four wheel drive. Also got diff locks. Pretty hard to stop and really tow a, big, tow a good load with that one. And that's got diff lock front and rear? Front and rear, yep. Wow. Yep, so uh, yeah, very hard to stop. And, uh, and that one? Now we go on to the, we got, the, these are the Mustang quads and then you've, you've got, the, that's the 400 Sport, so a bit more fun. And, uh, and then you go into the, the 500 Workhorse, which is, which is our main one. And it's, um, yeah, it's really a work, as the, as the name says, it's a work vehicle. Comes with a winch. It's got independent suspension, sway bars, a big fuel tank, 22 litres over most, most quads only have about a 12 litre tank. Real low centre of gravity, a great workhorse. Yeah, right. You've got it covered in every angle, eh? Hey? Yep, yep. For the off-road. And that, obviously, that's what yours is, so, uh, yeah, this is all ready to get back on the tracks again. That's it. Sounds good to me. Here we have the spare parts team taking calls to ship parts all over Australia. So here in the warehouse, we have over 15,000 new and used parts to choose from. Additional water and fuel storage, roof racks and ladders, warnings and rooftop tents, pool bars, side steps, rock sliders, custom bar work, and a whole lot more. Oh, wide body ones, eh? So how many were made of these things? Um, I'm not sure exactly how many of these, but I have a dual cab one, which they only made five of. Is that right? Mm, yeah. Yeah, so. And what have you done to this one? Uh, we've, we've done a bit of work to it. We um, upgraded the turbo and added an intercooler. And so we, um, not quite, but nearly doubled the power out of it. Yeah, so it right. made it a bit more drivable. Yep. We also um, changed the diff ratios to 4.1s from the old 4.7s, which makes it nicer on the highway. Yep. And um, we added diff locks as well where we were, we were doing that. So it should be pretty hard to stop Ooh. this one. Go anywhere. Yep. Unreal. No, they're, they're a beast and a half. They really are. Multiple work bays and staff numbering more than 20, there's always something going on. In addition to logbook servicing and repairs, we also do trip preparation and vehicle customising. We can do the lot here from basic maintenance right through to a full engine rebuild. Well, it looks like the trucks are ready to go again. Yeah, just finish off giving them a wash and they're right to go. Excellent. Well, British Off-Road have built the camera truck for the Off-Road Adventure Show, which is on Channel 10. And not only that, they built my truck from the ground up as well. And the great thing about that is they can build a truck to suit you. And it doesn't have to be standard, it can be fully modified, whatever suits. But these guys know how to build them. So the boys are doing a clutch and rear main seal on a TD5 Defender at the moment. But we also do gearbox and transfer case rebuilds and all that as well and uh, but in this case just a uh, clutch and rear main. So we mentioned earlier about my uh, dual cab six wheel drive as far as we know there was only five of these built and this is it here it's um, similar to the civilian ones except all the armies are wide body uh, they have the 4BD1T Isuzu turbo motor in and the old four speed that was found in Range Rovers and counties uh, with a few military modifications um, she's pretty well standard at the moment, but if you check back a bit later on, I'm sure there'll be quite a few changes. Well, you can see these guys are serious about Land Rovers, and that's why they've been doing my trucks for such a long time. Well, I hope you've enjoyed what you've seen here at British Off-Road, because these guys know their stuff.